I'm really curious if he's going to make it across the bridge first. That'll be the deciding factor. Uh, one it of these teams, really I believe it's key. Mine Inc., uh, plays a long game usually, um, looking for denial and uh, just kind of holding out. Um, Absolutely. But Cockblocker goes are fast. Rushers. Yeah. Yeah, they are rushers. So <coughs> whoever gets across, a lot of times that comes down to uh, controlling the map, really. Hopefully, Bill. I, I figure probably both teams have done their homework on this match. This, uh, this match has been squeezed for just about every strategy you can come out of it now. Uh, there's slight variances, but for the most part, everyone basically knows what to do. And uh, E. Carter, if you're not vanished, you should vanish, just in case. I don't know if you are or not. <coughs> Apparently, right. my live stream. Oh, no, mumble. Mumble, never mind. Oh, someone shot off already. Oh. Jesse Yang taking a big hit. Oh, we had someone from the other side hit go or go down too. Yeah, Wind Waker fell, but <coughs> he did get a few more blocks off. This bridge building is just such a key. Ah, we have a secondary bridge far, far away being done, and they are halfway across, taking fire. But Falakarar, oh, oh taken out. He did lose it. I would say oh. two or three more blocks. Blockers are across. They made oh, a nice. jump. They were able to do a jump. Now let's see what their plan is. They might try to hold them back. If they hold them back for any kind of significant amount of time, that'll be the end of this match because the cock blockers are fast. It's interesting that Wind Waker is choosing to get dirt because if you punch down <coughs> the tree, you get four, um, you know, planks out of that. So it's it takes a little bit less time to actually do a tree, and they're across. It's a jumpable gap, but they are across. All right, there we go. Yep, the uh, the fraps. Uh, actually, I'm glad you guys mentioned that. I wish you guys had mentioned it a while back, though, because I forgot to hit record. So I'll have to just import this April is taking stream up over as a from. Sniper? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll have to import the stream over In the instead of actually here? having my HD version up. Seeking higher if I ground. Do that. <coughs> Wind Waker and Falakara are moving forward. In fact, Wind Waker is traversing the forest. Let's see here. What is he do What's Chessie doing here? Solitaire on the left side is already through the forest. Yep, watching over here right now. Falakarar and Wind Waker are, uh, Waker are both. Yep, we are approaching the mountain. They are really <coughs> close. I'm hearing someone. Yep, we've got a firefight. Ooh, Nobody has fire. been able to really get too high on this mountain <coughs> yet. It looks like the cockblockers made a rush for the uh, Red Wool Bridge to go ahead and try to set up some kind of defense. Solitary Wolf, though, going alone right now against two of the Mine Inc. guys. Now, Solitary typically gets up on this mountain, but he just hasn't <coughs> had a chance to get up into a perch yet. Um, slippy, I would, or slipper, I would rather just have it either be one quality or not, because it's too jarring to really mix and it up like that. And he's coming back It wouldn't down. look good. He set up the TNT. Now, that is a, a bad thing for them to happen, basically, for a long game. A short game, not a problem. You know, that, that kind of breaks it down for them. Uh, either, now I wonder, neither one of us are watching the iron blocks. I wonder if that's what's going to happen. <coughs> Interestingly enough, like you say, it is really, it's not the end of the world. The iron and diamond earlier on are much more um, devastating to lose and difficult to recover from than that set trap. Although it's an easy thing to just set off quickly. We have a bed set up on Mine Inc. side and we are continuing to have heavy fire with April. Now I had someone uh, mention that they saw like a no cheat thing going off. Uh, that no cheat thing is pretty unreliable for the most part, uh, at least in the experience we've seen on PvP maps, and they were saying they saw one team's uh, firing arrows very quickly, uh, which is actually very easy to do for people who haven't really messed with it that much. You can have a solid stream of arrows coming out of those bows if you know the right timings uh, and just doing half draws. Sometimes it's not about doing the most damage, sometimes it's just about suppressing fire. And it looks like the cockblockers have gotten both their iron and diamond blocks. Choosing not Solitary. to blow up the other ones. Sorry. No, you are fine. Solitary has not decided to press forward to make the bridge. He is instead holding a position on the ledge <coughs> trying to help with fire. 
A rough TNT cannon being set off there. Uh, destroying... Very oh, very nice one. Very rough. Did a bit of damage to their lights, but has up. not touched the ladders if that's what they were going for. Okay, apparently... Alright, that's what the problem was. Alright, there we go. <clears throat> yes, don't worry about the soul thing. If it was popping me up every half second, that's one thing. If the fact yeah, is just be glitching to get around in there, them, but you know. still, we're we're really not being terribly <coughs> effective as far as uh, really stopping their their descent. Let's see here. Looks like Saltar used a little bit of TNT there, but it's not in any kind of dangerous spot. And uh, like yeah, we were talking about earlier, Saltar is using uh, his bow to kind of give suppressing fire, not trying to kill, but just trying to occupy. <clears throat> and a constant fire. We have no armor on most of these guys, although there are, is some leather stop to be made. We now have two on Mine Inc. trying to uh, take out Solitary, and they are just missing the top of his head. And I want to say, I think I've seen this before. Um, Solitary did this before in a match I saw on this map, uh, basically being the one-man distraction crew. And there he goes. Solitary is working to get his position <coughs> of height advantage on the mountain. <coughs> he, I am he seeing a spread cannon being set up over that. here. If you look above the uh, blue... I see yep, it. You see it. There it is. Now that is mine ink side. They do typically destroy blue and really make it difficult for anybody to get in there. Yeah. And that looks like that. It's probably Falakarar doing that. I wonder if this will work. If we have World Edit installed here, I think it will. Yep. Yep, I popped inside. It is actually a uh, TNT cannon. I remembered that you can use the compass to do uh, to pop through. I'll get out of the way. Sorry, I bumped Falakarar a little bit. Set up in there? Yeah. Yep, that's going to hurt. Well, they've definitely devastated some of the ladders. And it's, again, it's always these last few. Those are the worst <coughs> to have uh, affected. Now, we've got Mine Inc. over here uh, by the Red Wool Bridge, already making a push for it with TNT Bridge. Uh, that can come back to bite you very, very much so, um, if you're not careful. Yeah, Looks they're like easy blocks to get right away, though. Yep, Solitary Wolf took a, took a spill. Popping over here to the green wall. loading up for another run on the cannon. <coughs> Excuse me. Wind Waker is continuing to suppress the fire. He is not trying to run red yet. Looks like neither teams have approached the green wall at all. Still just uh, virgin territory, basically. Oh, yeah. That did some damage. Up and down. Now... This is impressive because one, you've really devastated their ladders, but two, up and down the mountain, they don't really have a good foothold now. <coughs> they have to recreate, either dig through or replace blocks, which of course puts them at um, arrow fire damage. It seems like Mine Inc. has made the, uh, the call on their team's behalf uh, to try to slow the cock blockers. They know they're fast team, but they, they can put the brakes on them hard enough and fast enough uh, they will throw them off their game. Yeah, now it looks like April just took out Solitary, <coughs> so he must have been uh, trying to make his way back here. Fellow is uh, setting up Waker. another chaos cannon. I saw that. Wind Waker is running across. He may actually start running red since there is nobody to shoot over here. I can't really see why else. You know, the Chaos Cannon taking out more of the ladders, all of the iron and coal. Uh, there's a little bit of iron left, but uh, not much. Not really much to bother with. That's at you know, <coughs> six blocks. Might be some loose floatings. Yeah, there are some uh, entities <coughs> over here. You guys see how close that came to blowing up their own bridge? I did not see that. That would have been the, um, pretty bad. They got the TNT trap on Hawk Blocker's side, and some of the TNT bounced up and just short of um, Mine Inc's bridge. Mine Inc did take out some of their own ladders for blue, however. Looks like uh, Wind Waker from Mine Inc is actually making a run on the Red Wool. Uh, no armor, not seeing anything else with him. He does have a bow, though, and it's not uncommon to see them shooting from one lane to the other, even when they're navigating that maze. 
I have seen when uh, Waker <coughs> do that, and he, I've actually watched <coughs> him run this naked twice. So not an uncommon move for them. And I know that it is better to have the diamond <coughs> armor or any armor, but it, you can actually still beat this thing with nothing on. Take a look around here and shoot some ladders. I saw an arrow fly by, but I'm not sure at who. I don't think it went anywhere. Both sides are going to have difficulties with shoots and ladders. Cockblockers <coughs> are more hurt with their ladders, but they do have collateral damage on Mine Inc. side. They're still going to have to deal with that. Do 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 do. -do. Wind Waker's being very careful as he <coughs> reverses the pain water. Cock blocker's side on bedrock. Not seeing anyone. Beep for someone there. And again, this is a position mm. where you have to be very careful. You, you see how he's keeping his uh, head oh well. to the lava. You'd much rather <coughs> get your head get sucked in than your feet, because when, just the nature of a Minecraft game, if your feet touch, you tend to get drawn down into the lava. Your head can kind of skip along. Yep, there is Wind Waker. Uh, I'm going to let these guys kind of cover that and let us know how that's going. Uh, he's taking a lot of hits there. Not a lot, actually, just a little bit. There you go. Looks like he's got the red wool. Yep. Getting it out is going to be a problem. <coughs> and as usual, we've got a little slime in there. <coughs> now we are actually seeing the cock blockers starting to gear up. I think that's where they kind of disappeared to for a few minutes there. I'm seeing lots of, uh, at least one player right now in diamond. I'm going to look for another one. If there's another one in diamond, we'll know that they are uh, doing good. Now this <coughs> is a prime opportunity for Wind Waker because there is nobody outside of uh, Red, <laughs> alone Skelly. Oh, we do have Chess. He's made his because way no over cheats, here on basically uh, not. cock blockers to he yeah, hit the mountain. I love that too, but still, he's, they have no bridge. <coughs> he is largely un, unaffected over here. There's still, uh, we had someone else ask about the no cheat uh, prompts that are coming up. Uh, we basically ignore those because they are a little bit buggy. If you ever have seen one of the Dutroids days, uh, community days, you will literally see it pop up like a billion times. Um, maybe not literally, but you know, you'll, you'll see it a bunch. And it doesn't mean anyone's cheating, it just means lag, latency, uh, maybe they're firing faster than no cheat realizes you can actually do it at. Uh, it's just real iffy. Exactly, so no one's <coughs> going to point any fingers. Now, at first, Gramps has TNT. I, I, he's got a button down. He's actually making a cannon here at the Painwater Bridge. At first, I, yep, there it goes. I thought he was just putting a, a bit of a barrier with TNT. Where was this at? At the Painwater Bridge. They have taken out Mining's <coughs> Painwater Bridge completely. Very nice. Good counter. I was just saying they, he's going to be largely untouched. He has no foothold to get out of there. None. Of course, we knew that when they put the TNT bridge out. That is a risk. Very nice. Let's see Let's here. Let's take a look at where everybody else is. Yeah, uh, it looks the like... The blockers are running the chutes and ladders. <coughs> Very nice. Uh, yeah, I was looking for uh, any more of the cock blockers. Uh, looks like they haven't made a run on red wool yet. Um, I think they've kind of just relinquished that for the time being. Now that they've taken out the bridge, um, Wind Waker will not have a way back. Uh, he'll be sitting there. Yep, there he is. He just got there. That was beautiful. <coughs> Solitary is was running <laughs> shoots, and their solution was to place down fresh ladders. Now there is a full stack of ladders in Fellowship if you grab them, and of course plenty of wood everywhere, <coughs> but Falakarar was on the ball with the shooting and he hit the ground too hard from arrow fire. Yeah, we've got uh, Wind Waker just hanging out at the beginning there of uh, Pain Water with a bunch of wool. Um, he's got nothing right now. And uh, unfortunately, it sounds like we our official ref is having to head out. All over okay, here e at the, uh, 
beginning of the <coughs> mountain here. April is set up a couple of barriers, and she is uh, shooting. Looks like Falakara is covering uh, relighting, and we have reset our bed, as well as taking some shots. And Killer is poised to take some shots. We've got Gramps trying to long-range hit Wind Waker as he's taking cover outside the entrance to Painwater. Um, right now, I think he's just trying to hold on until he can get some backup and get someone out there to rescue him. Because right now, he is basically stuck. It might he actually is. be a good idea for him to uh, stash some more of that wool somewhere. Because uh, this is the, Mi the Minecraft form tournament rules, so he could actually, you know, obsidianize his own side here if he wanted to hide some... Uh, you know, red exactly. wool back inside the water there. So it's not a bad idea. And then just kill himself and come back and try to rescue the wool himself instead of just waiting. He can also, yeah, as he's put that wool on the outside just to wrap around and then uh, kill himself and try to make the way back. April is completely no armor and she's going against, it uh, looks like, uh, I want to say Ch Nika. It's Nika over here who is in full diamond. I'm glad to see that there's still arrow fire. A lot of times people see diamond and they don't even want to bother, but you can still take them out, knock them off, cause them issues. <clears throat> but uh, in 1.1 it is pretty dang hard. You usually want to try oh, yeah. to time your shots out to the point where it'll be the most damage. You can give them some fall damage and that will help, you know. Absolutely, try to knock them off. If nothing else, you're harassing them so they don't just have free reign. Exactly. Oh, we have a bridge <coughs> being worked on over here. Let's see what's going Looks on over like here. Looks like Cockblockers is working on uh, reinforcing a bit of a bridge and suppressive fire to keep them on mining side from being able to build their bridge. Looks like they're going for the, not the cover style or si style of ri uh, Painwater Bridge. Uh, they're going for the kind that leaves you open so you can shoot unhindered, but you won't be knocked off. Right, the safety rail, the safety rail, which is much, much more uh, reliable as far as your death. You, you usually die like that, being falled off. The locker are, I just saw, you get shot off much easier than you actually die from arrow fire while you're crossing. <coughs> Gonna take a look over here at Green Wall and see what's going on. I don't see anything yet. I didn't see anything either, and it looked like, as I said, Mine Inc. had several people just in a firefight. This is probably going to come down to recovering red and how they're going to get green. i take a look at uh, shoots again. Neither team's made any sort of attempt on green yet. <coughs> nope, it's still untouched right now. Even the diamond below deck is still there. Uh, it looks like Mine Inc. is just kind of for gone, all like uh, the armor and whatnot. Kind of risky. I've seen that before. And, you know, just not even bother and go. We had a little bit of leather and that's it. As you can see, <coughs> the cockwalkers have got their they're recovering from the ladder damage by putting their ladders on the inside of the uh, obsidian I'm sorry, of the uh, bedrock. They still don't quite have it all the way to the end, though, and no one is... up oh, there he right is. There. Solitary is attempting it. But he's having to jump and catch the ladder to get down. Now, what I'm watching right now is actually... I was watching Gramps because some people were saying, you know, uh, people were shooting arrows too fast. Actually, what he was doing, now that you can actually see, see the animation, was those half-drawn pulls. It's literally like you just click for... You go click, release, click, release, click, release. You can just spam arrows. And I think that's what some of the confusion is coming from. Yeah, the half. I just had it on video for people. Solitary right now he's just like aiming. a champ. He is working these ladders. He's got to have actually he's getting close for you guys. Catch because you can. Uh, Let's see if he starts spamming them. again, which is normal. And, uh, that's fine. Catch the ladder, go Half down. Or full he is release. on the very last one. If he does not get shot and he makes it in here. They're going to have blue n nailed down. All he has to do is get saved. Very nice. Yeah, that's a good strategy. <coughs> Interesting. He's not even using the ladder that's already there. He's choosing to place his ladders on the side. That's what we're talking about right there. Fire. I will have to take a moment here to remind people in the live stream, be civil, be nice to people, otherwise um, I'm not against having my moderators remove you. I appreciate you guys watching, this I want to just keep things as uh, civil as possible, so. 
if I see any name calling, things like that, I'm sorry, I'm very sorry, you will have to go. Um, but please, let's just bring it in, enjoy the game, uh, leave the drama for afterwards. Because there's always drama, but, you know. <laughs> oh, they are in trouble. Solitary <coughs> is taking fire in iron, but he is about to get in. Yeah, once you're in there, you've got it. You are totally <coughs> safe once you get in. And... There he is. Dead. He's good. They've got blue. Now, they still have to get to the monument, but uh, getting in <coughs> is, is pretty much you got Let's blue. Let's do this. Yeah, once you are able to pass it around the back, you're set. I think I think Gramps may be going for the green wool. Okay, that'd be, that'd be about right timing, because now that he's in the blue wool, he doesn't really need backup. Yeah, Green, Gramps and Wind Waker are both back at the uh, Green Wolf Fortress. Cheshang has made it all the way across, and he is hanging out at the uh, at the red. Hey, Winkleson. Crossed the bridge. He has not got done pain water, but he looks like he's going in now. Now, what happened with um? Oh, who was it that was stuck there? Wind Waker. Wind Waker. He has died. There's a splat right <coughs> here. He's oh. on top of the the green wolf fortress. So they're leaving red as received but not recovered and are moving elsewhere. Cheshang also naked as he runs the... <coughs> well, but he has, I believe, that is leather in his hand. Popping over here, let's see. That's fine, Williams Jennings, or William Jennings. Uh, let's just end that talk in the stream. Uh, we'll worry about that afterwards. And honestly, uh, no more talking of cheating I right now. I don't need uh, the drama Mike in has the chat. Done their blue at all? <coughs> oh, chest didn't quite make the thin part of the lava, and of course went up in flames. Uh, it is not necessarily taboo. It's just taboo in the middle of the in the middle of the match while the stream is going on. Uh, if you guys want to review things later on, talk things over there, that's fine. Uh, but for now... People taking fire from no. Nika. Back into the match here, let's take a look. Chess is already back and working on it again. Still looks like the Mine Inc. guys have not really geared up. Um, they are just sticking with their bare skin right now. Yeah, I see that. <coughs> Chess is entering pain water again. I'm going to go ahead and take a look. We do not have the uh, pass up. Oh, the pass around is happening right now on uh, cock blockers. That is solitary putting the blue wool behind the bedrock. Looks like Mine Inc. is finally making a push with a three high wall and walkway uh, to, to try and recover their red wool. I thought so. Solitary is stripping down. He's probably going to just suicide from here and get back in the game. <coughs> there he goes. But they haven't lost Ooh. that because they did put it away. Ooh, what was that? Uh, just being shot off the bridge onto a the embankment of the mountainside there. Gramps and Nika exchanging spots on the Rip Painwater Bridge, and it sounds like uh, you got something there? Yes, we have Mine Inc. attempting shoots, and I don't see anybody Oop, to give a cover fire. Let's see. Looks like Falakarar is <coughs> running. He is using blocks to get up, because they did have some collateral damage on a few of their ladders. And no one from the other side seems to even notice him. Yeah, for a minute I thought the guys on the Painwater Bridge were moving to reinforce that section to hold them off blue, bo uh, blue wool as long as they can, but it is not the case. Uh, I think they're just hanging out right now. Wind Waker 02 taking a hit, though, and going to the ground. We only have a couple more <coughs> here, over halfway through here. Falakarar is about to make it. He keeps looking up, but there is no fire coming in. I tell you, running shoots and not having an arrow to the face is a beautiful thing. Yeah. Jesse has made it to the red wool. Let's pop over there real fast. Bam. And... Bam. There we go. Still no fire coming in, although they fast. may have noticed from the ladder. Oh. Yes, they are firing. And... 
no armor. That really hurt. He lost it. He was shot off on the very last ladder. Yeah, right now they don't have the staying power to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with two guys uh, unable to be knocked off the bridge. If they built it the other way around, I'd say, yeah, shoot at them, uh, because there's a good chance you knock them off. But right now they are, in, they are basically emplaced machine guns. Yeah, now you can <coughs> run... You can, I mean, you can run blue with nothing, and, and you know, I, I've done it, but you'll last a lot longer doing the dance on those ladders if any kind of armor, iron, diamond, anything. Chess is working his way out of pain water. Now we got, uh, Falak. I think it's who it is. Follow. Falakarar. Uh, he is uh, kind of taking cover right now in a little, uh, the Calco. Oh, he just jumped off to kill himself, I guess. Not sure why. I think he was okay, but oh well. I'll, I'll, I'll default to that. They may have called team change, or they may have wanted him someplace else, and it was quicker to bite it. Hey, that's a good point. So let's do a, a little rundown. Uh, Red Wool on Mine Inc. is ready to be picked up. Uh, sounds like they are coming back on the cockblocker side, though, with the red wool right now. Uh, so red yes. wool to them right now. Uh, blue wool also to the cockblockers. Um, they'll be moving on green real quickly. Yeah, they're <coughs> going to want to close this as soon as they can. Having blue and red, uh, you know, green is a PvE battle. That's that's nothing. A lot of teams will leave that one for last because it's it's not the the critical one. Let's see, popping over here. Chess is moving across. Gramps is giving cover fire. <coughs> now we got Killer on Nine Inc. Finally gearing up in some leather armor, getting ready to open fire um, as the team is coming back. But it's not going to do much good since most of them are in. Uh, he's probably passed off the wool to the other teammates in diamond armor. Chess is across <coughs> and he's tucking in. He's going across the mountain into their little cubby hole. Nice. Red is basically secure. Yeah, red's red's 100 percent secure. I would imagine. Uh, besides being on the monument, it's good to go. We have a cannon down at uh, Gramps' end of uh, left side. Uh, where at? Which wool? Oh yeah, at at Payne. They're, yeah, they're taking out uh, mining's red wool. Is trying to get the red that's hanging Oh, I see. The I see. Oh, oh, air shot at it. Oh, he got. He's got this though. If he really, if he times it right. Yeah. He he he's, he nicked off the first one. <coughs> oh, nice! He got there it just it right past over gone. here. It exploded like right next to me, like over here. That's crazy. Uh, each team has That's someone weird. back at the green wall area. <coughs> that was beautiful. So that basically puts uh, Mine Inc. on Red Wool back to square one. They've got to run the whole thing again. It is confirmed. They have already done <laughs> their pillaring. Blue is secure. Alright, so definitely right now, uh, Cockblockers are in the lead. Two wolves yeah. to, I believe, maybe even none. Two to one right now. Or two to none right now, possibly. Oh, we have cannons going off at the uh, green wool. Yeah, the pass round has not happened yet, and I don't believe they've actually made it all the way to Blue Wool on the Mine Inc. side. No, they have <coughs> not. Hmm. So now the pressure is going to be on Mine Inc. to hold off uh, the cock blockers here at Green Wool until it is until they're able to get their so get themselves collected, basically. You said we have cannon fire. Yeah, uh, one cannon. It uh, looks like they took out the diamond, or at least some of the TNT on the side of the Mine Inc. Uh, dungeon. Yeah, opening this up lets everything, all those mobs, crawl around and mingle. That <coughs> definitely puts them at a disadvantage. Right now, it's still pretty quiet over here. I'm not sure where they're at. Hmm. Yeah, I'm really curious too because I'm not seeing Mind Ink. I mean, unless they're tucked in. Oh, there is Wind Waker. He is at the uh, the uh, wood house. That initial wood house. Hmm. Let's pop around there and see. Are they going down for supplies? 
looks like he's heading down as a resource run. And where are you catching him at? Wind Waker, at the very beginning. Oh, okay, resource I see. Run. Oh, he's finally going for the armor. They finally realize that they need that armor, I think. <coughs> Which they're going to need at this point if they're going to try to hold off, uh, you know, upwards of, you know, two or three guys shooting arrows at them in diamond armor. Yeah, they're going to need armor. Yep. There's no way you can stand against that. He is doing the armor run, but to do it now at this point, that is one less person shooting. Ah, <coughs> solitary taking a, <coughs> taking a zombie de death right there. He is having troubles in green. Let's pop that open. There we go. That's right. Now I have seen Mind Inc. do this with uh, uh, and win with the very little armor strategy, but this uh, it's hard to go against guys in iron and diamond. Very nice. Yeah, Wind Waker finally making it out of there with the iron, uh, iron blocks. All three of the other teammates <coughs> from Mine Inc. are yep, right good here point at up, April's kid. little uh, just so front area it. at the mountain before shoots. The one thing I was and about to mention is that uh, they also left the diamond down there. They just went straight for the iron blocks. Uh, I think he may have tried to just cut time and get back and get the diamond from the castle, maybe. Mm, maybe not. May not. May not work out. We'll see. Looks, Looks like, like he's gonna make a cannon. Uh, where's that? Uh, green wool. He's um making right now on the underground diamond level. The Lockerar is attempting shoots again. He is making his way down, but they know about him. There is <coughs> fire. He hasn't even made it to the first uh, ladder, and he is getting fire just you as know, he crawls down. I've seen them. I've seen people do this before. I'm not sure if it's a good idea. They don't have anything lit up down here, and they're about to open up all the well, not, may not all the rooms, but part of the rooms that they'll have to traverse whenever it's actually time to make a run on their green wool. And they yeah, haven't they haven't removed the the TNT below it either. Um, this could go very badly. Looks like Nika is the one who is stationed at the beginning of the Painwater Bridge, bearing down on the Lockerar. Uh, Falakar is actually running back to the green wall. So he's bailed. He was working his way down hmm. towards the thing, but he was under such fire. <coughs> it does look like Mine Inc. has abandoned their bridge building efforts towards Red Wall. At least, hopefully, or, you know, not hopefully, but hopefully they, uh, <laughs> barely a word stuck in my mouth. Anyway, they, uh, will probably try to reconvene on that bridge building once the other team has moved on from there. But it doesn't well, look like they're going to do that, because Nika is over here just opening fire whenever he sees a, cha a target. And we do so, have cannon, but nobody here to, uh, to man it. Um, and Solitaire is uh, almost on the bottom level of the green wall. I'm right, assuming whoever there. was set to do that lovely cannon that's all set up with the redstone and everything uh, just was taken out by... Oh, Solitaire died. Looks like the blaze got him. Now, uh, what happened, though, is when Waker set up the cannon, I think he set it up for future use. I'm not sure I would have done that. Oh, there he is. He's, He's back, back now. He may have needed a button or something like that. Pressure plate. That'll do it. <coughs> uh, oh, no. Not to... Oh, it set off more their side than anything else. Yeah, it definitely did a number on their side, and that's going to cause some problems, <coughs> but it's going to cause both sides, and it does, I agree. It mm. looks like Mine Inc. actually took the brunt of that one. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah. looking at both sides now, uh, Mine Inc. did more damage than good with that cannon, because uh, I don't think they cleared out the TNT below on the side he was firing from, so it actually made it worse. Uh, looks like and Wind Waker right. is now just basically boarding up and trying to hole up, it looks like. He did <coughs> not go for the diamond at all. Mining diamond still sitting there. Uh, no free without walls. They did not. They did not clear. They didn't check below before they fired. I think they just thought it was gone. Um, I, I think that's honestly probably what it was. They thought it was already gone um, because they heard the explosion. They could see the explosion for a bit. Uh, so it's probably just what happened. Oop! I heard a creeper go off in there somewhere. Now, looking for the other members, it sounds like uh, probably it's just Solitaire or whoever it is on the Cockblockers team that's supposed to get Green Wool. 
uh, working on getting that right now, while the other three are basically just holding off Mine Inc. from getting their goals. Yeah, and we have <coughs> two of Mine Inc. Looks like uh, Gramps is setting up fortification. He has some water in here. I'm not sure if he's looking to build a cannon, but he does have water in here. And he is building up structure. We have Killer and April on Mine Inc. side. Again, just poised over here in different uh, sniper positions, trying to hold them off. Where is Falakara right now? I'm not sure. I haven't seen him in forever. I'm going to go low to avoid the uh, fire here. Let's check on Bob. Uh, Falakara is gathering the diamond at the fortress. Okay, I'm popping back over there. Okay. By the way, if you didn't know this, uh, use a compass. Uh, left click will teleport you where you're pointing, basically, and right click will push you through a wall. It's on the I server with uh, MC Edit. That's why I've been using to jump back and forth real quick. Sorry about that. You <coughs> are fine. That's nifty. Yeah, Painwater has been completely abandoned over here, besides <coughs> Nika keeping his position for uh, snipes. Looks like, uh, yeah, looks like they've used some water to try to get down into the green wool dungeon. A cannon going off that shoots and ladders. <coughs> yes, that is exactly what he was doing. I saw that water in there. I knew it was going to be a cannon. He took out the uh, forward spot where April had been uh, hunkered down behind. They still have some of their other fortifications. Oh, I see. There it is. They're tired. They're going to end this firefight. Oh wow. Oh wow. That that's going to hurt right there. That's a good one. April saw it coming Oop. backed out or is returning from death, but she is in the leather Oop, armor. Out. <laughs> that chest fire. is actually empty, so it's not going to do anything that bad for them besides just wreck their uh environment. I saw you open it right as the cannon came in. <coughs> yeah. It looks like solitary again, dead by blaze. And all three, yep, we've got Falakarar, <laughs> Killer, and April all stuck on the other side right here. That is a nice cannon. Uh, someone is saying Gramps actually designed that. Um, it's a little more complicated than most cannons. It's not an easy one to get set up in a real quick hurry, but it is definitely doing a m magnificent job. Yeah, I saw it was just slowly coming together. Oh, I mean, it's it's again. short, compacted uh, TNT burst. It's more like a shotgun pellet hitting more than a spread cannon. It's like a, it's nice. I like it. <coughs> yeah, as he was building it's it for overshoot. a little while, you could just see the uh, cobble slowly oh, nope, coming together. That's good. But as soon as you see that water in there, you know it's going to be a cannon because there's no reason to mess with it otherwise. Yeah. Or solitary. Right now, my chat is saying the, that's like a, that's a nice cannon, that's a devastating cannon, whatnot. Um, that's a good design. It's like I was saying, it's not an easy one to get set up on the fly, but if you have the time and you have the armor and all that stuff, and you set that up, goodbye to their whole mountainside. It's gonna go punch right through it. Yeah, and you you can't. I mean, it's it's like the bridge situation right <coughs> off the bat. You you can't. You just open fire to try to get across. And Gramps is not Wait, giving them any no, quarter. He's just continuing to load and fire that puppy. I think I just picked up three arrows, but that's no big deal. Pause just long enough to shoot. Alright. He's adjusting his spread. There we go. Boom. Gramps just killed himself by jumping into the middle of the TNT. I'm not sure why he did that. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. Solitary should solitary. grab that stuff while he's running past there, but I guess not. <coughs> you can see we've got the red and the blue oh, just stacked funny. up and ready to go. Yes, yeah, Slipper, my uh, my inventory's full. I don't know what the deal is. Do it again. The blaze I'm gonna double check it. Eating him up. You know, honestly, at this point, I think they should take another person. Look, it's full. And go down with him for support to help destroy Look. the uh, the spawners. Full. Um, Chessie is actually back here. Waiting. I don't know why I picked up that stuff. Or maybe he picked it up now behind me. That could be it. Hmm. Is heading a whole other direction. <sighs> no, he's <coughs> heading back. Okay, that's just where they have their forward bed. He is heading back to try again. So Chess is in there working it too. Um, <coughs> yes, he's currently in an arrow Excuse blade me. with Wind Waker. Oh, not anymore. 
All that explains where Wind Waker was. Solitary and Chessy making their runs now. Using the water pillar as a kind of way to get up and down there, but already a spider on their tail. <coughs> yeah, water can only get you so far when it's such a destroyed open mess. It, it's really hard with all the different mobs lingering in. Now I'm seeing gravel. Does that mean they've already been down there? Hmm. I can't see that. <coughs> I really don't want to get too close and have anything spawn because of the extra body. They got their hands full as it is. I'm not sure what he's doing. Wind Waker does Greetings, have Monsieur Apple. Hand, and it looks like Apple. he's trying to get in a position to harass them. They know <coughs> that they're going for green, and that is really... that they have to hold them there. That's a good point, but I didn't feel like going down there without... I wanted to watch those guys get shot at. Unfortunately, <laughs> it's just a matter of cock blockers getting the uh, the green, because yep. we, we still have no progress other than just they're pinned <coughs> down and fighting uh, oh. over here. That cannon's done too much. Yep, I used the compass to pop inside the walls here at the fortress. I see what they've done now. Um, with two of them, they now have easy access to destroy that spawner. He needs to use a pick, though, instead of a sword. That would uh, help. Spellwalker has managed to get around the hole created by the cannon. I see that through the mountain. Let me go down there. And he has got full diamond armor, <laughs> it appears. It's a compass. They may be trying to attempt a shoots run. <laughs> Apparently, some kind of accent to certain types of people is slipping through um, when I say the word compass. I don't... Sounds fine to me. <laughs> yes. <coughs> Blocker has dug through and come at from the inside of the mountain and has come out at the first <laughs> I am, free ladder. without walls. Uh, but I work pretty He's well. He's going to have to drop and catch. Oop. Sorry. Uh, yeah, I actually tend to hide my. Is that Gramps did I just pick again? Up an arrow through the wall. Hide my southern accent uh, unless I want it to come out, y'all. <laughs> um, let's see. Looks like the cock blockers are making a strong push right now towards the spider spawners. Um, I think they're actually going to try to take them out. Let me out. Let me out. Blocker Let me out. is in full just, diamond and he, he is officially running shoots. Right now, I <coughs> don't know if Nick is not looking or what, but he's not getting any arrows, uh, arrow fire on him. Uh, Nico was just at the um, beginning of Pain Water. Yeah, that's where he had been uh, kind of, yeah, that's where he's, he's seen him. Now, one thing, one problem they're running into over here um, may or may not end up being a problem or not for the cock walkers. Oh, I see what they're doing. Very nice. Um, they, while well, finding the blaze spawner, they had uh, generated a bunch of poisonous cave spiders, but I think now they've made it past there, and they're going to, um, be able to cut most of them off. <coughs> Falakarar is riding these, uh, ladders like a champ, but nice. he is still getting up. knocked down diamond armor or no diamond armor. Sol Solitary wolf He's punching through and uh, getting the green wool. Blocker <coughs> is taking so much fire, he's actually bunkered in by a ladder. Oof. But he's still getting hit. It's doing him no good. He's running again. Splat. And Let's diamond armor over All right, the gravel. edge. Looks like they'll be pillaring I out of here with gravel. All that is left down there is their blue, or is their uh, <coughs> feet for diamond. So yep, that's following it. These guys. He's got. They officially have all three wolves. Now they've got to get them to the monument. Yep, and they have split up the wool between Chessy Yang and Solitary, and now making the run back. Uh, they're actually not making the run run back. They're uh, riding the water elevator up, which is going to take a little while. Spiders go wild. Let me out. Stupid three members of my Inc are there coming back to the, prevent them from getting to the monument. That's all they can do is hold them down because they have all three wool at this point. And they are all uh, clad in diamond. <sighs> all right. Well, 
My stomach thanks them because I'm starving. <laughs> well, it was definitely a late start with whatever those issues were on the uh, server, but I'm mm -hmm. so thankful that we were able to use the <coughs> official Reddit tournament servers. Thank you so much, Author Blues, and of course, CoStar for giving them to uh, us to use to begin with. And thanks, E. Carter, for stepping in to uh, sub ref. Uh, I know that wasn't in the plans, but thank you very much for doing that. Absolutely. <coughs> Yeah, uh, one of my player or one of my chatters over here, uh, Gogo Joseph says it's kind of like the five minutes then good game. So we all oh. we all know it's coming, you know, at this point. Oh yeah, and we you can see the green wool <laughs> out. Solitary is shooting. Wool is dropped off and available. Um. Yeah, one of the players also now said this would be the good time for them to troll the other team, but that's usually well that is actually frowned upon by both tournaments. Yes, yeah, once we, you we got it, you you knock score. it down. Yeah. For a second, I thought Solitary had just fallen off the face of the uh, the, the I edge did there. Too. He was forward. <coughs> they are digging down. Uh huh. Really it's interesting. The whole beginning only reversed instead of trying to get across the bridge first. Oh, they're trying to set up a cannon for him real quick, but it's not gonna do any good. It's too high. I don't think they realize that he's going down. Yeah, he's shift. He's shift dropping. There he is. He's down there already. He's going for the safe oh. route, just ignoring the bridge, and just going to pillar back up, which actually exactly. isn't a bad idea. Wind Waker does <coughs> see him, though. He is giving fire, but don't really think he's getting, uh, getting in any danger right now. There's no. arrows all around. I mean, sure, it'll take longer to get it back, but it's not going to stop him. And especially with all three of the mine ink, or three of the mine ink people over here. Uh, trying to stop him. That means one person's out there trying to run wool, and that does not give them enough to do it. Actually, he's actually gone in. He He's in. No pillaring. He's in. He's just cutting oh. through the mountain. Yeah, they'd have to blow, uh, blow up the entire mountain, basically, to get in there. And uh. mine <laughs> just blew up their own side, it seems, <coughs> a little bit. I heard. Yeah, I think that was a desperation move there, but, you know, or just for fun at this point, because they realize uh, the end is near. Yep, that that didn't go well at all. <sighs> Hopefully he has a strong pick, or at least he's being aware of that. He does still have a pick. But a good one. Hopefully it doesn't wear out. Oh! Very interesting. Oh, I know what he's done. He dug straight through and went into the iron and coal side of things. He's just going to take the stairs up. Yes. Uh, yes. He's not, actually. He's uh, digging a pillar straight up and then dropping box behind him as he goes. I don't even see where he's at now. It looks like he's in the he's middle of the shift. mountain. He's, um, if you come over to where I am, he's right through the wall between I think I see you him. guys. He's about to surface, yeah, it looks like. Yeah, he's about to surface. So he did cut through a bit, <coughs> and then he's going straight up, completely safe. Still I'm getting a shot. Bet he's got all three. Oh yeah, he's got all three. I I would bet money on it. Absolutely. Still giving fire. And victory. There you victory go. to cock blockers. That was a beautiful thing because good, neither good team game. gave up. Mining still continued to give fire right to the very last moment. Awesome. Let's see if I can do like a nice aerial but, shot. But like we said in the beginning, Solitary Wolf already had the invitation to go to the Reddit tournament, so there will not be two teams joining from Tom's tourney, only the one. <laughs> I like the secondary victory monument they use there. Uh, the in the blah, I can't whatever that is, the guard thing, the there thing with go. the blocks. Oh, that's fantastic. <coughs> Congratulations to cock blockers. No. Oh. <laughs> they finally took him out. Yeah, rampart. That's a that good word a for it, the rampart. That was a fantastic game, guys. Good job all the way around. Absolutely how far this will go. loved it. Hopefully y'all found it worth the wait. Ooh, Should we hop into a chat?